Hi, uh, so Anand is here with me and I can uh, make use of him because I usually don't have a partner so today I want to settle one thing once forever in the history of Wing Chun okay? What happened is this Last night, after they watched my uh, history you know, the, the, the video on the, the history where I present the, the, the technology evolutions from 1500s down to today with all the books. So, there's a person who wrote me this. We need to put a stop to this one person who is going to destroy Wing Chun with the Tai Chi lies. Okay? So he's saying that he there's this person who uh, using this Tai Chi lies uh, going to destroy Wing Chun. Okay. I read this, and that's why I want to make this video. And uh, it's good that Anand is here so that I have a partner. And I can show you what is going on exactly when I before I show you with the simulator. Probably you don't get it. Okay. Now. We are not going to put down Tai Chi. Tai Chi is the art by itself. We are Wing Chun. We have all our rights to define clearly what is Wing Chun is about. Okay? And we don't want to badmouth other martial arts, including Tai Chi. But we cannot allow other people saying that Tai Chi is more advanced than Wing Chun. Tai Chi have this internal force Wing Chun doesn't have, Tai Chi force flow, like even when my 6th core element, which is I coined it, 633, people is taking it and then just adding this Tai Chi Jing and everything and a whole bunch of story. Okay? So we have, we Wing Chun have all our rights to clarify what we do. We don't want to badmouth other people, they do their own job and so forth. So, there's no worry about anybody can destroy our Wing Chun. And nobody can destroy Wing Chun with their lies, whatever they do. As in my book here, it's presented already what Wing Chun is. So, the only way that Wing Chun can be destroyed is if we all uneducate and we all keep ignorance and do not know what is Wing Chun is about. Okay, so it's, it's, it is us, not them. And people will not have the opportunity to BS you if you know what you are doing. Okay, so today I want to show you the difference of the Wing Chun and Tai Chi. So once for all, we clear this case, okay? Anybody can, can choose to believe uh, 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 Tai Chi is the older than Wing Chun, Tai Chi, Jing have this, uh, all this magic stuff. Well, that's up to anybody's freedom, like religion's freedom. But here we talk technology, okay? Now, let's start in the Qi Ji Guang time, 1560 in the book of Qi Ji Guang. Tai Chi is derived from that from the long fist type of art. Wing Chun is from the substrate. This is a two different type of art. Okay? So, example. Get your ready stands. Okay, get real from here. Okay. Long fist is at this distance. Anand can punch me. Okay? Can punch me. I punch him. This is the long fist distance, okay? That is the long fist distance. Long fist is the, this type of art. That's why in Tai Chi, they practice their Peng Jing. Push hand, push me. Oh, sorry. Oh, so, oh, sorry, okay, put both hand. Put pressure. This type of Peng Jing, okay? That is the Tai Chi type of Jing. Be it, it is this type, this big uh, uh, frame or structure, or this 
structure here. This is still a Peng Jin. It is a long face type. I'm going to explain you why exactly. This is a long face type. So any you see anybody doing Peng Jin type of stuff, this Peng Jin type of stuff, this Tai Chi push Sheng type of stuff, you know right away that is never Wing Chun. That is a long face. Their distance, they are fighting in this distance. They walk out in this distance. They can get this close. That's the same. The same. The second thing is, if they do this and they do this type of push hand or this type of fudging, those are still Tai Chi long face type of stuff. Why? The minute I do this. I push him, he push me, I never get close to him. Okay, now you put some pressure on me. You see, he push me, I push him, disregard of if I push him here or I push him here, I never get close to him. There always he push me, I push him away, or let's try the name push hand or walk off, those kind of stuff. Okay? So those type of stuff, if you see people using this punching type of stuff, you know it is not Wing Chun. It never did Wing Chun. Okay? So long fist, this type of uh, techniques, this type of uh, gym. So I want to define to you, gym, what is gym? In Chinese term, gym is just a use of an application of force. Jin is an application of force. So meaning that you have this force and then you make use of it. And that is called Jin. It's nothing mysterious. In Chinese it says, Li, uh, Jin si li de ling yong. Jin is the uh, very uh, the, the, the applications use of strength. So Li is strength. Jin is the use of strength. That is Jin. Don't read more than that. If you read more than that, you end up be like what? April 27, 2017. But that guy who show all his Jin in his uh, CCTV get beat up by the MMA uh, player in China. Okay, so get rid of those things. Those are just even the Chinese today don't believe in those stuff. Okay, so Jing is just the make use of strength. If I don't have strength, I cannot, I, I cannot, I cannot uh, 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 generate or, or, or generate the the Jing. Okay, so I need to have this thing. The second thing is this: when you do this kinds of stuff, you need to what? You have to have what they call the structure, jiaz. Okay? Structure. So like if I'm the ball, like here I have a structure, I can take the force, those kind of talking, those kind of stuff. Okay? Now you, you put it down there, you push me. It's, it's those kinds of stuff. Okay? Be it here or be it here, the same stuff. Now I hope that you understand, you see this clearly, this is the long face Tai Chi stuff. It doesn't mean, it doesn't have to that I have to be good in Tai Chi or not, but you know the characteristics. Okay? Now, let's go to Wing Chun. Wing Chun is a short strike up. Get your brain, okay? Wing Chun is a short strike up. Wing Chun is not going to fight here. Okay? Wing Chun is going to fight here. Get in here, okay? Yeah, you stay stable here. Okay, here. It's easier. So, uh, stay uh, settle there. Okay, so I'm going to teach you. Wing Chun is going to come in here. Okay? Wing Chun is not going to stay in this distance, push in this distance, or pushing walk off in this distance. Wing Chun is going to come in here. Okay? Wing Chun is based on Lin Xiu Tai Da, dissolve and you strike right away. 
It's not playing with all any kind of gene, okay? So if I come in, I don't I have to I don't have to touch his hand. As soon as I can strike, I can I strike him. Close. The minute I put my hand there with all this gene, okay, if you push me in, it is warming up all this thing. That is not Wing Chun. Wing Chun is going, you come in, it's like going. Okay? It just go in. It just stick at him. It just stick at him. Okay? So that is Wing Chun. Okay? Get that straight. Now, Wing Chun have a concept. It's called give in without giving in. It's called run. Er pu run. Okay. Usually, if you look at the Tai Chi, the concept is for here, I have to use my gym, I walk you off, I can push you, I can fire gym and those kind of stuff. Wing Chun's concept, remember this, is called Zhang Er Bu Rang. This is the Shaolin Shock Strike concept. It means giving without giving. Meaning, if you want to attack me here, you want to attack me here, I give in, I give in, Without give in. Now I give in, but I walk in already. This is Lin Xiu Tai Da. Okay, you dissolve him and you, you, you strike him right away. You see, I am not here trying to dissolve your gene or force or anything. You want this location, you shoot at me, I come in. I give it to you what you want, it's a smash you, I come in. So the body. In order to implement the concept of give in without giving in, you cannot have this type of uh, thing there. Well, this is another type of art. I mean, if they are good in what they are doing, they can do anything, they can have a good fighting, whatever. But Wing Chun, don't do this. You want it, I get in. Okay, I get in. Once I go in, I roll in. So, give in without give in. If I am here, I'm going to give in from here, give in without giving. If I am here, okay, here, because there's a two condition now. This now is because he's a, a, a fighting zone. No, here, here. He's fighting zone that I can get in from the outside. Another one is come from the other side, you see? Or you just face me at the angle like that. Okay? Facing me again, right? I can get in here because if I am here, if I am here, I try to get in here, I'm late. So giving without giving is from here. I come in from here, okay? So I force him out. So so now is that I give him without giving. Okay, try to go away. Come on, you cannot go away because I'm close already. Okay? So in Wing Chun. That is called give in without give in. Meaning, you don't do this. Punch, bong sao, la, and then the other kind of stuff. You don't do that. He come, right away you strike, you come in already. Okay, that's give in without give in. You don't, you don't do punch, bong, stand there, or punch, you don't stay outside. Wing Chun is, I don't wait for you to finish this. You come in, I come in. Always the timing is, you shoot in, I shoot in. I'm not going to go play with your hand. If I play with your hand, the other hand is going to shoot me die. No, straight jab, okay? So it's going to get to my face right away, okay? This is very fast, this is real deal, okay? So the Wing Chun per 1840, because we are, remember our celebration is this? That is way how they fought. This is called stringing the body, contract, right? You put your stand up, right? Now I, I zoom him, right? His, his uh, zone of power is here. This is what I want. Okay? So there's no all this kind of 
almost done. So, this is what I want to show you today. Also, the Wing Chun Jing, because it's a close range fighting this way, it is not using structure. The ancestors said this is a snake. Why? Because at this location, I have to keep moving. I don't have the luxury of the space and the structure. My whole body is dynamic. So, Wing Chun is using the torque mechanics and the snap mechanics to generate the force. The torque and snap mechanic is not using this structure. So in Xiaolin Tao, the reason why we do all this kind of deal in Chang Q, that is because we are training our torque and the snap power. We are not doing like Tai Chi. No matter how big frame or frame or small frame Tai Chi is, it never is a short strike like Wing Chun. The power generations is never like that. Okay? So I hope that this solves all this issue. Remember, the issue is us Wing Chun. If we get educated, nobody can destroy Wing Chun. None. The person who can destroy Wing Chun is us if we are ignorant and stay idiotic and keeping thinking of this magic mind power, magic, this uh, 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 chi power. If we keep trying to chase him for those things, we screw ourselves up. While us, in the short strike art, like in the Chi Chi Kong time, it is a momentum play, right? I'm not going to play this with you because this is a long face stuff. So, you bait him, you go in. Now he can throw out the right? You get in. That is when to momentum play. Spend time in the momentum play. Stop messing around with the chi power, mind power. The real deal is the momentum play. How, what angle I want to get in? What is the distance control? Okay? And how to do giving in without giving in. Giving in without giving in is very important concept I want everybody to know, start from today. Okay, so I release it now. Meaning, he shoot a punch at me. I give in because I don't want to stay here to mess around with him. That's what Chi Chi Kong said. Okay? Not what off, not withstand, not blocking, but only one strike. He wants this, you give him. I want this thing, I want this thing. Okay? Why should I play, play Jin with you? I'm not playing Chi Sao with you. Okay? So you go in. If he come again, you, you shut him. You just let him out. Okay? You just go jam in. So the timing is. You don't wait. He come, you give in. You just give in. Okay? And all the techniques use this way. Okay? So I hope that this clear everything with you. Same thing with Er Mace Er Zhuang. You take a, a, a look at the people who play Er Mace Er Zhuang. Yes, Wing Chun is using the technology. Let me tell you what happened. Short strike, we know in the 1784 is called Qian Wu Chun Ge Jie Zhuan Lun Fang The strike is continuous without the separations of, of, of an inch in, in, in space meaning that it's very short meaning that when it strike here it is going to go all the way okay Continue, bang, 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 bang. Okay, very fast. That's Chen Wu Chun Ge. Jie Zhuan Lun Fang, meaning that when I do that, I'm spinning my body. Okay, you keep him busy. Okay, once you close, you close in those way. That is what Wing Chun, the Jing, is about. So don't ever get into the structure and all this kind of stuff. Where is this? This is all in the 
children how to make your guilty sense. All is there. Now, the Shaolin, we, we say that it is, we just say that the strike is continuous, do not have a, this, uh, 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 have very minimum discontinuity or less than one inch uh, uh, spacing, those kind of stuff, and then it turn and a uh, 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 core and so forth uh, to generate power. Now, that is Shaolin 1784. The reason why they act in Ermei, snake slide one move, is so such that my hand will look here. Yes, better. Because right now I have better technology to refine my seven goals. Okay? And then you have this internal, this Chinese uh, meridian thing come in. That is from the 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 uh, the Ernie's Earth one. However, the fighting stance is a short strike. Shaolin short strike. A short strike from Chi Chi Guang time evolved, keeping evolved and uh, 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 expand and refine and uh, in, in, in Shaolin. Okay? So in 1560s, going down to 18, uh, 1784, we know that that is the Shaolin short strike. That's why it's in that book. Okay? So you can see, as well as I say, Tai Chi has its own, uh, own art. We don't badmouth people. But we need to know who we are. Okay? And then, the only way other people can destroy Wing Chun is that we become idiotic. And we don't know who we are. And then keep adding all this kind of stuff. And then mess everything up. But if we don't do that, we have educated. We are educated. Nobody can mess up Wing Chun. As far as I point out, all the books is there. I show you all the books there, which you can trace. It's such that it is not me you want to listen to. You go check into this book. It's like you have the, uh, the development manual or development documents of Windows 10 or the Apple iOS. You can check into everything. You can know clearly. Got nothing to do with anybody. You can check that technology. Okay? So this is for you today. And thank you, Anna. Thank you, too.